What's going on, Smexy? Ha <laughs> hey. ha! Hey, you think you're gonna like me, Zhao? Appreciate it, dude. Oh, Iron's in trouble. She's got to be healed. Oh crap. Oh shit, only nine damage. Wow. Oh my gosh. Are you serious?
Oh, fuck's sake. How did I save the distance before? What window are you want to close it at the back there? Yeah. Oh, yeah, lovely. Percy Hutchins, I love Shining 3. I've been trying to get into Shining Resonance, but it's just not as good. Hey, per hey Percy, how you doing, bud? Yeah, I love Shining Force 3 as well, man. Super awesome game, man. Super awesome game. Shining Resonance? Shining Resonance Refrain? <laughs> no way, man. <laughs> I mean... Like... This, this is, like, well, made back in... Um, the 90s right from camelot shining resonance is one of the most recent ones right from sega and uh i think it's pretty clear one when kit wants camelot you know relinquish the reins of it like the shining games are not as good as the ones developed as uh, from by them anyway so <laughs> but although they're not that bad right i heard but i don't I I haven't really played them that much, but I'm pretty sure they're not as good as this one. What have you got uh, Shining uh, Resonance on, Percy Hutchins?
Did she did she Lulu like that uh Udon noodle? <laughs> Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's probably making you hungry. <laughs> oh, really? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh crap. Oh, are you serious? Oh really? Oh that sucks man. He pulled out a level f level two Phoenix on Dante. Yeah, uh, Percy, like, um, that one's, uh, the recent signing games have been made by, like, Sega, right? So, Camelot are the ones who met, who are made these back in the 90s. So, yeah, there's going to be a world of difference, man. I hope one day that Camelot come back and uh, develop the Shining Force games again, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but it looks much better than uh, isn't it? Did you see it's much cleaner? Did you see it looks much better now? It's much cleaner there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Really? Let's see if he does the same thing again then. Oh my gosh, he did, huh?
Okay. I think it's probably best just to leave him back then, I guess. Nice. It's going to cost What? That sucked, man. Well, she's done then. I think I probably need to egress back to church, man, maybe. Damn you.
Hunters doesn't get a go, right? Only Symbius does. Oh, I need to heal up Irene then. Yes. What? Fucking <laughs> unbelievable, man. No, don't be confused, Dantes. Shit. Really? Oh crap, man. Oh, that's annoying.
Oh, good shit, Calm. Well done. That's crazy. Oh, crap. Nice. Oh crap, man. I need to get them heels going and fast. Yeah, it's good, isn't it, man? Yeah. Yeah, the suit, the suit, yeah. The suit is lovely, isn't it? <laughs> Yeah. People would love that. They would be queuing up for that from yeah. isn't it if they tasted that. So nice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Seven fifty, eight pound, maybe, yeah. Dazzle shot. Let's go. Ooh, nice. Nice. Um. 
Crap. <laughs> nice. No. Yeah. 
damn it. Wow. Ah, nice one. Nineteen. Well, Sammy didn't get hit. Ah, so Jobong Tua explodes. <laughs> it's 
Jobong Tua, explode. <laughs> Sayonara. Kaput. <laughs> Masup got the house. Gone forever. Oh, see, Alexa said something. <laughs> Yes, power crash. Oh, nice. Let's go. Wow, lovely, excellent. Wow. 
Oh, absolute havoc, man. You lose. Yeah, good shit. Oh, he took 16 damage though. Good shit, Dantes. Go Symbius. Hmm. Sick. Yo, Grey Fox. Namagarasu, let's go. Sega Saturn. Sega Saturn forever. Oh, thank you for the follow, Sh Schneiders. Welcome, everybody. Thank you for the raid. Thank you for the raid. Shining Force, man. Sega Saturn Classic. Namagarasu. Thank you so much, man. Uh, 
I love Sega Saturn, man. I love Sega Saturn. This is one of my favorite games on Sega Saturn, man. Genesis. Genesis. How you doing, buddy? What were you guys? Uh, what were you guys playing? Were you guys playing um, Virtual Fighter? Good, good, good. I hope everyone's having a, a nice weekend over in Brazil. Is the weather good? The weather here is a bit cloudy today. I was watching Namagasu play VF with his cousins. Oh, you guys getting better? You guys must be, you guys have been playing quite a lot, right? And <laughs> you've been streaming quite a lot. So you, I'm expecting some big improvements from, from, from all of you. <laughs> I was, uh, Gray Fox, man. But bash in, bash in. Thank you for joining. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Yeah, I'm in the middle of an uh, intense battle. I I don't know if everyone, anyone um, knows about this game, but it was split into three parts and I'm playing the first part. The first part was translated, was given a Western release, but parts two and three were never given a Western release. But the fans have translated it now, so I'm going to play through all of them. I'm super looking forward to it. Super, super looking forward to it. Um, what to do? What to do? Who else has played this game? Anybody played Shining Force here? It's a Sega Saturn classic, man. It's right up there with the very best. Oh, gosh. What do I do? What do I do? Ah, uh, yes, the last entry of this one was called Shining Resonance, right? Uh, no, no, no. This game, uh, yeah, 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 sorry, um, you're right, you're, you're right in terms of, uh, yeah, um, it was called, uh, Shining Resonance Reframe, right? But since this game, it's been it's changed developers to Sega and they never they've never been quite as good but yeah you're right it's uh the, la the last game was called uh, Shining Resonance Refrain right yeah yeah it's a JRPG it's a it's a it's a strategy RPG that's right there's a turn based one but it's really one of the best man it really is it's right up there with the very best of them the the story is great the characters are great the characters are wonderful in it the the stories get it gets really quite political and quite quite in depth should i say and uh it's like fire fire emblem you know if you have played fire emblem on nintendo's uh, consoles but this is better than fire emblem and for sure man it's like i wish Ka actually the developer of this game makes like the works for nintendo now mostly camelot they've been doing like the mario tennis games uh because they fell out they fell out with sega when this when sega was about to release the sega dreamcast yeah. Yeah, but f Shining Force 3 is better than Fire Emblem any day. Well, I, I really believe that because in Fire Emblem, I don't think, for me anyway, the gameplay is not quite as good and the characters are not as good anyway, but, but from what I played anyway. so But I haven't played all the Fire Emblem games. So. Alright. 
I don't want to die here. I'm trying. I'm doing a. I'm doing a run through of this game, with trying not to lose a single character. So if I lose a character, I I reset it, isn't it? So, uh, but it's difficult. It's difficult. I've never done it without losing a character. So, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. By doing stuff from hard. I know. I think I think Camelot said they would like to take up the the Shining Shining Force games again for Sega, but Sega haven't accepted it or something. Sega haven't you know made an offer to uh, Camelot because the Camelot's still about. They're still about. They're still working for Nintendo. Have you played the uh, the the scenario two and three at uh, Grey Fox? I have them, I have them. I'm gonna play through all of them. I've never played through them. To, until the end. Um, I think... I have to use a, a potion. Yeah. But if you played, um, if you played like a turn-based RPG Genesis, then uh, you'll know what this is about. Next level games are making sport games. For, uh, right, right. Um, what do I do? What do I do? Let me get, let me check the health of each character. It's, it's critical that I, I maintain the health of them, otherwise they could get ganged up on and, and then taken out. I need to heal up Murasam. Oh, I mean Noon right now. She's low on health. This RPG is my religion. Last one I played a couple of weeks ago was Star Ocean. Currently waiting for Star Ocean. Oh, really? Nice. Nice. I haven't played the Star Ocean, but I know of it. I would, I would like to try that game sometime. Genesis Star Ocean. Oh, he's going to go. For, oh, crap. He's gone for the, he's gone for the middle. He's going to go with his Phoenix lower too, isn't he? I highly, highly recommend this game. I mean, yeah, oh yeah, and um, Grey Fox, did you see the Sega Genesis Mini Two? I heard or Sega Mega Drive Two Mini Two. I think Sega after that one, they might do a Sega Saturn Mini or Sega Dreamcast Mini, but it'd be so hard to cut out some games because the Sega Saturn has so many amazing games just like this game is just like oh, I, I don't know how they could leave some games out I hope they put all the, the great games in oh here we go currently wait for stone I play Golden Sun oh yeah I did but I'm away for the full list then May merge the games that came with Astro Mini. Golden Sun, yes, yes, yeah. Golden Sun is like a, a spiritual kind of sequel, but it's not a, a, a direct sequel to this game. But I played it too. I played it too, but it's not quite Shining Force. <laughs> it was on the Game Boy Advance, right? Yeah, I had it too. Right, let's cast the aura. On noon. Yeah, I have the I have the Astro City Mini. It's just it's just there. I, you can't see it. It's just next to my TV. But yeah, I really like the Astro City Mini. Yeah, I'll show it, I'll show you to you. Yeah. 
pretty darn cool, right? I got I got the little seat that comes with it as well, man. <laughs> click, click, click. Nice. Yeah, that seat's expensive as well, man. I was just wow. I was just um, sadly they are overpriced. Yeah, it's cool, right? It's cool. It is cool, man. I do agree, but they are. Yeah, they're putting virtual racing on the uh, CD Mega CD as well, right? On the Mini Mega Drive Mini too, which I'm really happy about because I wanted it on the original Mega Drive Mini. Okay, let me check the health. What happened? What happened? Did he attack Dantes, right? Uh, is Symbius been attacked? Oh yeah, Symbius has been attacked. I see, I see that, I see that. I need to get rid of that um, sorcerer. He's dangerous. That sorcerer's dangerous. He's got freeze level three on him. Harley motorcycle. Oh, sick. Let's go. Oh, nice. And he's seen illusion. Sick. Uh, uh, who should I take out? I'm not sure who to take out. Hmm. Pressure bomb. Wow, first time I've seen that attack, man. Utterly destroyed. Wow. This game is sick, Grey Fox, man. I love it, man. Honestly, man, if Sega ever did a Saturn Mini, man, that would be just unbelievable, man. But they would have to get it right, though. You can do it, but you got to get it right, man. Right. Take it, take him out, take him out, Sybil, you gotta do it, you gotta do it, you gotta take him out. Yes! He's gone, he's gone. Ooh. Oh, level 8 as well, nice. Oh, Hagan, Hagan, Hagan. Um, what to do? Um, what to do? Yeah, he's. Uh, do you have this game, uh, Grey Fox? Honestly, I've been honestly. I completed this game back in nineteen ninety eight, Grey Fox, for the first time. Yeah, and I've I've been wanting to play the subsequent games, Scenario Two and Three, since then. <laughs> 
I've been wanting to complete it, you know. And and I'll show you, I'll show you, I'll show you something. I've got all three of them. And I've got the I've got the bonus disc as well. Let me show you. I I played Holy Ark, Ark Holy. Let me show you. Um, I got my. Uh, you want to see my little Sega Sega shelf, Gray Fox? Oh, my Sega. Hold on a second. Let me get it up. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. This is I'm actually. I'm gonna show you my uh, my Sega Instagram. Um. Now this is my uh, steering wheel and gun. I got uh, some of my pictures of my collection here, man. I love these games on Xbox, man. They are sick. Especially Panzer Dragoon Auto. It's so it's so low wing dragon, man. Here's my Shenmue, some of my Shenmue collection, man. What do you think of that, man? In some of my uh, Sega Saturn games, Enemy Zero, Panzer Dragoon Saga, uh, Riven. Yeah, yeah, the LP. Uh, here's my Half Life, my re reproduction Half Half Life. That's awesome, man. Here's here's me modeling some Shenmue merchandise, man. From the Sega shop. Here's me doing some more modeling for the Shenmue merchandise. Oh, thanks, man. Uh, here's my uh, Skies of Arcadia CD soundtrack from the Sega shop. That's really cool. Oh, here's here's me doing some Ryo Hazuki man. Haha, <laughs> my Ryo Hazuki cosplay with the forklift. <laughs> Here's my Bayonetta cosplay. How do you like Bayonetta, Grey Fox?
I was promoting some Persona, Persona 5, man. Here's my Bayonetta collection. With some pictures. You never cosplayed? <laughs> oh, it's fun, man. Here's some pictures of my cosplay down here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here's my Sega chef, man. How'd you like that? Sega Saturn. Sega Dreamcast. Got a Ryu Gagatoku, uh, a PS3. But for the time being, I gotta focus on saving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand, man. You gotta save them reals, man. Oh, thanks, man. Oops. That's what it looks like in the dark. You like that, man. <laughs> You're liking that, Grey Fox. New projects come up. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Have you played Shenmue 3, man? You're an OG. <laughs> OG man. Oh, here's my Bayonetta cosplay again, man. You like some Bayonetta, Grey Fox? It was difficult to attach the guns to the heels, man. I bought, I bought it on Kickstarter. Yeah, I, I don't like to get the game, really. If I'd have known the game they, they'd come out with, I would have said no, just keep it at one and two. More Bayonetta. I did it, the Hyper Japan, I think. Yeah. That latex might hurt. Yeah, it's super tight and it's not comfortable. I don't like wearing it, but it looks good, man. <laughs> crazy, man. Crazy. It's hot and it's tight. Dang, man. The hair as well. The hair is super uncomfortable. One of I had because you had to build it with a special thing inside of it, like a plastic cup or something like that, to make the beehive, isn't it, on the top? Resident Evil. Got like my Resident Evil too. I got it on uh, Nintendo 64 and Sega Dreamcast, man. There's another one of my... I've got more since I took this photo. Man. Some more Bayonetta. Oh, Propeller Arena. Remember this game? It's a re the Reaper of... 
Uh, like, like wings got it eat now. I make okay. See you later. See you later, my man. Thank you for stopping by, dude. I'll catch you later. Yeah, catch you later, my man. Right, I'm gonna get back to Shining Force. Yeah. Not sure though because I have to write some things. Okay, okay. But that was it was fun chatting to you, my man. I'll catch you later, man. Right. Okay. Right, let's see how this goes now. Oh shit, my joy, joy pad's disconnected. Okay, I got a focus here, man. I got a focus. Wow. 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 Killer. Take some of the Wendigo, man. Oh. Should have gone with the lightning, but never mind. Alexa, stop. Go. 
Come on, Khan. Yes! Hey, Namagarasu! You still there, buddy? Are you? How you doing, man? Thank you for the raid, man. I really appreciate it, man. Were you watching? Uh, were you watching me show some of my Instagram on my Instagram? Oh, your friends went home? Oh, okay. No problems. Do you know this game? Symbius, it seems I have lost. I'm not the one who abducted Algernon, but I can assure you he's alive. Prince Auron took him to prevent Tristus from getting involved. Oh, oh okay, okay. It seems my last breath. I, I, I was showing everybody some pictures of my collection, my Sega collection. Would you like to see? Okay, here we go. I have a, I'll show you, man. Here is this. Yeah, yeah. Here's uh, my Sega Instagram. It's called Solo Wing Dragon. I post some pictures of my stuff. It? Yeah, here's some of my Xbox games, man. Love these games on Xbox, man. My Shenmue collection, some of my Shenmue collection. Uh, here's some of my Sega Saturn. Panzer Dragon Saga, man. Enemy Zero and Riven. <laughs> uh, four disc, uh, four disc games. Got my Half Life, Half Life Blue Shift on my uh, reproduction drink. Here's me modeling some uh, some uh, Shenmue clothes. Have you played Shenmue, Namagurasa? Here's me modeling some more Shenmue stuff. Oops. Here's my Dragon Force. My Dragon Force 1 and 2, man.
Oh, you love martial arts? Oh, nice. Awesome, man. Here's my uh, Shenmue cosplay, man. Ryo Hazuki. I started the third one, but I did not finish it. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't like the third game, man. I don't think it's a real... I don't think it's a real um, Shenmue game. If I'd have known it, what game it was, I would have just said leave it at one and two, man. Here's my Bayonetta collection, man. With some of my pictures of my cosplay. Here's my Bayonetta cosplay, man. How do you like it? I was, I was cross-promoting some Persona. Ah, here's my, uh, here's my, uh, Sega, Sega shelf, man. How'd you like some of that? Sega Saturn, Sega Dreamcast, the PS3, uh, Ryu Gagotoku PS3, man. Special edition. Yeah, awesome game, man. Awesome game. Yeah, yeah, that's the. It's, I think there's only like 10,000 of these limited edition PS3s, man. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Uh, at night. It's, uh. <laughs> Me and the uh, forklift truck, man. The uh, Ryo Hazuki. <laughs> oh, thanks, man. Here's my Bayonetta cosplay, man. Again, look. With the, uh, it's difficult to stick the the guns to the heels, man. Here's another one of my uh, Bayonetta. I was at the Hyper Japan. No, <laughs> I don't, man. <laughs> but luckily, the company gave, lent it to me for the photo shoot, man. <laughs> I was l uh, lucky otherwise, it would have been expensive to hire one, man. <laughs> Here's Resident Evil 2 on N64 and Sega Dreamcast. Here's some of my, is the same picture. My Sega Dreamcast and, and some Mega Drive and Sega Saturn. Yeah. Did you meet Suzuki Sam? Um, kind of, kind of. When we went to Japan Expo to meet him, he was there, and we was right, we was in front of him, but they didn't let us walk to towards him, like. But he saw us there, so kind, kind of. Yeah, yeah, in real life, like we were supposed to meet him, but then. For some reason, they made a made a raffle at the end, like for anybody to meet him, which they should never have done, which is just disgusting. Because we travelled, we travelled a long way. We went to France to to meet him, and we got within ten meters of him, and he could see us, and we could see him. But they only let some people to go up and sign stuff through a raffle for a lottery. I was so angry, man. I almost like, 
I almost just like hurt somebody, but I kind of met him. Give me some more of my bayonetta, man. Here's my Get Bass Fishing Collection. I say Get Bass Fishing Collection. <laughs> My Skies of Arcadia collection. Shining Force 3, the game I'm playing right now. Ah, oh, thank you, man. This isn't mine, but I put the picture of it anyway. It's, it looks awesome. Man. Oh. Oh yeah, here's my Sega Saturn, a lot of my Sega Saturn collection. This is my original Sega Saturn box I bought in, what, 1996? Here's my setup I'm in now. I'm playing, I'm in it right now, I'm, I'm actually sitting in the chair. Yeah, yeah, that's right, man. Here's my uh, my gaming PC setup, man. Here's the PS3 uh, limited edition. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, man. That's it. Here's my Sega Saturn Pro. Yeah, it, come, it comes with the beach towel, man. And the USB stick with the art on it. Where is it? Oh, there's the beach towel. There's the stickers for the joypad. There's the USB stick. <laughs> there's the game. And there's the instruction manual. They, you stick those stickers on there, but I haven't done anything to it. That's expensive, man. I, I, I bought it in Japan, man, and I brought it back here. But if you tried to buy one here, man, oh my gosh, it's like really expensive, man. Alright. It seems my last breath is near. Uh. I won't let you die. Dear mother. Something from above. Quickly, get back. Ah, uh, no problem, Namagarasu. 
Thank you for the, uh, thank you for being here, man. Wow, it's a dragon. It's a dragon. When are you streaming next, Namagrasu? When are you streaming Virtue Fighter again? A dragon controlled by Visanda took Graf away. Very perceptive. You defeated Braff and were able to enter and spin here. Unfortunately for you, this is this is the end of your army, Symbius. Are you going to challenge us in battle now, High Priestess Basanda? Ha ha ha. In time perhaps, but I have pressing matters elsewhere at the moment. However, if you get in my way, I'll show you no mercy. When are you streaming next, uh, Namagrasu? Smirk, we will control the secrets of the ancients and make Aspia the capital of the Bullzom theocracy. Oh, you need to make a schedule? Oh, okay, nice. <laughs> Nevertheless, you can do little but watch. You'll never... You'll never overcome the Imperial Army to enter Aspia. If you want to save Aspia, solve the mystery of the statue's black gem, then come face me. I have few hours to stream during the week. Oh, okay. Are you working mostly, yeah? But Sanda seemed to confirm the capital has been occupied by the Empire. If they take it as a castle, which is very well defended, we won't be able to challenge them from the outside. However, as Basanda said, Braff's gem may lead to a different solution. Uh, I've, as Basanda said, the Braff's gem may lead to a different solution. Aspia North Plain. Right. Himbia searches directly ahead. Finds the statue gem. Nice. Excellent. That's done. I finished the battle. I finished the battle just in time, Namagurasu. Right, now it's time to go back and save. Excellent. What could you tell me about this game? Oh, Namagrasa, this is one of the best games on Sega Saturn. It really is. You've never played this game before? This is... Have you ever played a traditional like JRPG before? Man, the story is like so great, man. Like it's really deep and like it's quite political and the 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 characters in it are really great, like it's just such an awesome game, man. You ask anybody who who loves Sega Saturn, and they will tell you this game is just one of the it's one of the brightest stars in its library of games, man. It's just an awesome game. Actually, the developer now um, of this game makes games for Nintendo Camelot Software. Oh really? But you played the, you played the RPG game before? If you like RPG games, you'll love this game, I'm pretty sure.
<sighs> oh yeah, which ones? Which ones? Let me let me just go uh just go downstairs for a second, yeah, I'll be right back. Like, have you played anything like, um, I guess the, the Nintendo's closest game to this is uh, Fire Emblem. Yo. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, that's it. Well, SNES Final Fantasy, yeah, so it's like that. It's basically like, yeah, it, it's, I think it's similar to Final Fantasy, yeah. But it's a really good clone of Final Fantasy. I think Final Fantasy came just before this game. But yeah, this this game uh you know the was actually released in three parts. It was the the first part was given a western release. Uh, Namagurasu, but it was really good, which is the one I'm playing right now. But the second, the two, the next two parts never got a official uh, English Western release. So I've been waiting to play this game, you know, the second and the third game since when I first completed this game back in 1998. But because um, because the Sega Saturn wasn't that popular, they can the release of number two and three, you know. So I uh, but luckily the the fans have done a fan translation now. So I'm gonna play through them now. <laughs> Dragon Quest Eight, yeah. But yeah, the all of the games are awesome man. Yeah, they're like the gameplay and the the characters in the game are just all are, are all really great. And <laughs> the the story is really great as well. Like yeah man. To totally awesome game man. If you if you if you get a chance, I, it's only on the Sega Saturn, you know. So, you know, there's so many there's so many great games on the Sega Saturn, and honestly, this game is one of the one of the best. Like, if you see it now, it's like the original copy of the game is going up all the time in price. 
Like if you if you tried to buy an original copy of Shining Force 3 on eBay. Let's sit, let's have a look. Yep, first one. First one on the list here. Wow. It's, it's two hundred and seventy eight pound sterling and eighty five pence. It's nearly three hundred pound man. Damn man. I'm just they're just going up all the time this game. Wow. That's basically three hundred US dollars, man. Yeah, or or basically three hundred euros, yeah. Three hundred euros basically. Or or close to it, or about three hundred dollars, basically. Uh, right. I've got the statue now. Fifteen thousand Brazilian real. Yeah, yeah, expensive, man. A, a, an original copy of this game, yeah. Man. I bought it, but I bought it back in uh, nineteen ninety eight. Namagrasu, so I paid forty English, or about you know about sixty dollars, sixty US dollars. Mm -mm -mm -mm. All right. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, and there's um there's actually uh there's actually three as I told you there's three parts, but there's one more kind of like bonus part to this game, which is called uh the premium disc. And I think it's got like a bunch of boss battles on it. And that's that's expensive as well, I think. It's like uh hundred and thirty four one hundred and thirty four pound fifty eight pence now. I can't believe it. I bought it like a few years ago, like for like way less than that, man. Way less. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. The, um, anybody who's like knows about you know who who who's had Sega Saturn, you know, this is right up there with the very best of the uh, because Sega Saturn's become very expensive to collect recently. Well, not recently, for quite a while now, so. Do you have any uh, retro consoles, uh, Namagrasu? A lot at long last, the great Estonian Empire has regained what was taken from it, Aspir. It's a matter of time before the other provinces surrender. You must be from Aspir army. Did you hurry back here, desperate to save your poor little town? Well, I'm afraid the capital of your beloved republic is ours now. Surrender and we may show, and we may show you mercy.
Yeah, these are the catacombs. Oh, you have a Mega Drive, PSP, and PS2. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, did you see Sega announced the Mega Drive Mini 2? Uh, recently, we have finally made it. We should be able to rescue Algernon. What kept you, Symbius? Oh, uh, oh, oh. Say hello to General Spiral. No, she's been taken captive. She's under mind control. Witness the power of the almighty darkness. It heals even the most critical wounds and defies death. Sweet, beautiful and powerful. As long as the dark power exists, the bosom set can't be defeated. The Imperial Army by joining us has learned of the beauty of dark power, but you. So the Imperial Army did conspire with the Bosom Sect to occupy Aspia. Yeah, so basically the, the story of this, the, I'll give you a general story of this game. It's like, there's two sort of like, uh, warring factions. Like, uh, one is the, the Empire, and then the one is the, the Republic. And your mate, you you play as the basically the prince of the republic, but there's also like um, and then they're at the beginning of the game they're in sort of like a, a peace conference, like they're trying to make peace with each other. But then there's a third party, like these religious monk sect that are trying to. Uh, they're trying to basically put them against each other by framing by framing the the empire by kidnapping one of the 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 the, the leader of the empire and then uh, they sort of they're basically just causing trouble and then you have to um, you set out to find out. <laughs> why they why they're trying to uh cause trouble between the republic and the empire isn't it because you re you don't know why this evil this monk uh cult is causing trouble and why they're trying to you know pit them against each other so <laughs> and uh this this um this woman here is one of the leaders of this evil monk cult and she's kidnapped this the general of the of the empire here yeah, and who's the, who is uh the one with the red hair yeah, so. so yeah it's it's a really good story man yeah are you gonna get it i i i'm definitely gonna get it as we destroy it as long as we're alive that's not going to happen By that and I must disagree. The Titan is attacking SB at the same moment. As you say, what did you say? The Titan, the giant warrior unearthed in Aspia, the guardian of the Vandal kingdom. With dark power, feeding off the destruction and chaos, the Titan creates bulls and will be to rule the land once again. To control the Titan without Bosom's aid. There is no way to stop the Titan.
There we are, the showdown with Bassander. Could it be the Titan, the guardian of the Vandal Kingdom has awakened? Could it really be attacking Aspia? You, I don't see why Bassander would lie. If the Negate King controls the Titan, we must defeat Bassander so that we possess that star. Oh, no. oh man, this battle is tough, man. It's really tough. Here's General Spiro with the Master Ring and the Lord Halberd. And Bassanda. There she is. Tanatos level 2. Oh my gosh. Blaze level 3. 280, wow. Man. This is one hardest nervous battle, but at least I'm on it now, man. Ah, and there's the, uh, there's the. Okay, I'm gonna call it there. I'm gonna give it a break there. But let's raid somebody else, man. And I'm gonna continue continue this again soon. Uh, Namagarasu. Thank you for dropping by, though, man. I'm gonna. Yeah, I'll see you. I'll see you soon. Yeah, I'll, I'll let, let me raid somebody. Oh, let's raid Timmyverse. Let's raid my boy Timmyverse. He's he's a cool dude. Thank you for dropping by, now, man. I'm gonna. Yeah, no problem, man. Thank you, uh, Namagarasu. You take care, man. Let me raid this raid. Oh, hang on. I, I accidentally made it. Oh, it's double, double I. Let's raid. Say hello to Timmy. He's a cool dude, man. He likes his Nintendo a lot, yeah? Catch you all in a bit.
as in what the devil or whatever that It's being slow. Um, Mario goes to the strip club. Mario is in a bad mood, but the thing that helps him is going to the strip club. Apparently, it's got four clears and it's fire special. Oh right, about Instagram. Sorry, right. Oh, uh, you've got the pictures from the Comic Con on your cosplay Instagram. Um. Okay. Sexy. Oh, that's good. That's uh, so good. Oh, cool. Did you see you with Zero Suit Samus on the Sunday then? Is that right? Did you do that? That's so funny. Yeah, so I was at the same Comic Con, if you're wondering. <laughs> Is it the same one in Mandan? Is that a McDonald's sign? <laughs> then Andrew. Oh, wait, right, so you didn't do a Samus then. Fair. Andrew, go away. Is the gym? Some people, McDonald's is the gym. Apparently. <laughs> Look at that. Do, isn't it? It looks like it. What's a strip club? The uh, Mario strip club. Mm, okay. I know something. <laughs> <It's the place>. God, <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Does it have this place now? That's good though, isn't it? Feasting at McDonald's all the time. Well, why would you do that? You shouldn't really be doing that, right? In general. Yeah, so it's the point before I wasn't really like eating McDonald's and I went back onto it and then stopped eating soon. Someone's just still in. Oh, you're supposed to wait. That's what's going on. Yeah, now it's now Luigi in this case is a hooker. Yeah. Right? That's a good level. Ridiculous. Oh, God. 